Guys, it's date night. What is going on everyone? Welcome to the channel. Today is date night. We haven't got super dressed up for a date night in such a long time. I needed it, we both needed it. <laughs> anyway, so last night I was scrolling on TikTok, leave it at TikTok, um, in bed, and I came across this one that was in a Nairobi restaurant. I was like, mm -hmm. that looks super cool. So we're gonna head there today. It is called Pepper Tree. I'm pretty excited because it, it looks very nice. Yeah, me too. So if you don't mind being a third wheel, well, come along <laughs> on our date. super good appetizer this guac is amazing it's like sweet potato chip and actually do much chip that we tried in our last video and new Tracy's I really favorite like but one thing that's really good is this cauliflower ceviche oh my goodness the flavor in it and I just put it all over our chips by the way um, it's so good it's really good it's different it's a flavor that I'm not used to but I like it did we tell them where we're at pepper tree in Westland just in case the atrium of this really reminds me of where we got married mm -hmm. in Halifax, lot six. It has that like atrium green, I don't know how to describe it, but really nice feel. Yeah. I'm getting like all wedding vibes again. And this wine is delicious. Oh, and yeah. my wife is very pretty. Good old date night. <laughs> okay, so when we do like those restaurant reviews kind of videos we always feel like we don't talk enough because it's always loud and complicated and everything but this time we brought a microphone i think we have it figured out hopefully it's working i think the audio is much better from what i was able to listen to all right so we got our tacos and they look phenomenal they look really good like i have really look, high expectations they now. look messy so i got baja fish and I and got chicken. Crispy chicken, but I think they're... I think they're yeah. swapped too, which is fine because we're sharing them anyway. Those are super good and they actually remind me from um, my favorite restaurant back home in Halifax, Antajos. Because when we go to Mercados, everything is very good, but it's not like fancy tacos like that with sauces and stuff, right? Okay, so back what we were saying about like not talking enough. Um, we have like three kind of questions about us and one of them we've only really answered in a live so I think it'd be a cool one to do. First one, most people know, how did we meet? So we, we, we're gonna, because it's a date night, we keep them, keep this around our relationship. So yeah. where do we meet comes, comes all the time, like in the comments, on Instagram, like it's a very, very popular question. So we actually met on a dating app, not Tinder. But and like our family did not know for two that, years. Yeah, probably. that's a fun fact. We actually did not tell our family for our first, yeah, I would say two years. It was actually, it was like right before we got married. I'm yeah, pretty sure. because even though like it's it's more common, you know, since maybe like 2018, 2019 for people to meet online, it's still not mainstream no. kind of thing, especially for like parents who, you know, didn't have that when they were younger and when they were no. dating. So and like I'm from a small town, so I feel like it kind of gives a weird stigma yeah, to it. So we even have, there shouldn't be. We have that weird cover story where we met in a party, a friend that introduced us and, you know, common friend stuff, which was complete BS. Yeah, it happened. <laughs> okay, let's try this one. So they're both very good. I'm not sure what that brown sauce is. It has nothing it's to amazing. do with Mexico, but it's no. very good. It's on both bars and it has like a tiny kick to it. It's very good. Yeah, we will be back. The next question is how did he propose? <laughs> and I did good, guys. I did real good. There's a long backstory. Just, I don't know Just wait. I go if you're a now. girl, just end the video right now. Because then you're going to put pressure on His like... His friends hated your, him. Yeah. You're going to put pressure on your future boyfriend like way too much for you if you hear this story. If you're a boy... Step up. <laughs> you watch, can do better. watch and learn. So, short version, he proposed on top of the Eiffel Tower at night. Long version, 
we were walking underneath it and we knew we were gonna go up and we just didn't know when and I didn't know anything at this point so he was like Tracy like you never decide what we do so he's like why don't you decide do you want to go tonight or tomorrow night and I'm like you know what it's getting kind of late why don't we go tomorrow night so we walk literally like five steps and he's like no 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 we're going tonight and I was like you just, okay, just asked me at no point once once we were literally under the FO tower yeah. I thought that Tracy would be like Let's wait until tomorrow. Because it was only open for like another half hour. So I was like, no, like tomorrow we'll get more time, it'll be cool, whatever. So then I was kind of ticked, not gonna lie. I was like, you just asked me and you're disregarding. So anyways, we go through the line and he's like shoving me, I say shoving, but like, he's like putting me in the front of the line, which we have this thing, like I know he goes first, I normally go behind him. And I was like, why are you doing that? Like, what the heck? So anyways, I let it go, we go through security, we go up. And we get up there and it's like a super romantic spot and he's just like distant and quiet and you, I'm like You didn't tell what I why I was shoving you, you around. Yeah, that's right. Because we were we were actually going through security and I had like the ring and everything in my pocket and I was scared that it was gonna like make the machine beep or something. He had it like shoved in between something. He showed me later. So anyways, we go up and I'm like you're not being lovey dovey and like this is we're in Paris on top of the Eiffel Tower, the most romantic spot. And you're just like I was a little stressed. <laughs> so anyways, I was like, okay, so I was just being me and like wiggling myself into you. <laughs> and then someone proposed. Like right um, yes. Right when I was about to propose. See that part I did. The couple yeah. beside me proposed. The dude dropped the knee and I was like, Are you kidding me? <laughs> so now we went on the other side of the like the little platform where we were at on top of the Eiffel Tower and I waited kind of 30 40 minutes probably because Tracy was like oh my god this is so cute and I was trying to like let that vibe die <laughs> before doing the exact same thing yeah went around the other side he proposed and here we are you guys know how much we like Disney and there's actually uh, I think it's an American jewelry store actually has people. a yeah people's actually has a Disney collection it's and beautiful it's, it's it's a real it's a real like fancy ring and everything but it's actually a Disney ring it's Tinkerbell you don't know unless you're a Disney person when you look close we're gonna try to order a dessert but the kitchen closes in uh, five minutes and 37 seconds so excuse me excuse me you know what this is the second best fish taco I've ever had in my life. After Antaos. Exactly. Yeah, Antaos. Guys, if you're ever in Halifax, Nova Scotia, Antaos, damn. Tell them I sent you. May, hopefully they remember me. <laughs> that's, that's your favorite. That's love. It is love. Can we can we get the uh, the chocolate ganache chocolate? Thank you. Whew. With three minutes to like, spare. Just in time. <laughs> <laughs> right now, like I'm putting a lot of faith in this shot because like we're when we go to the restaurant, we don't bring the main camera, we just bring like my iPhone 11. So it's like I don't see the screen because the camera in the back is better. I feel like we could be putting low on it. Hopefully it's good. It's angled up a little bit, but... Okay, what did we get? So we got like a chocolate ganache cake. Looks pretty good. Oh, it's like dense. I have high expectations. Yeah? It was pretty good. Best two desserts still go to <laughs> Indy. And the other one is Talisman that we had that chocolate fondant. That cake. was really oh. good, yeah. And we are back home after a very enjoyable mm. evening. That was so good. Those tacos were yeah. phenomenal. And I have to say, like, Price wise, oh, it was very reasonable because the bill that you saw at 7300 uh, cash, I think, mm -hmm. half of that was a bottle of wine. Yep. So, That's overall, really like, good. it's pretty good. The three tacos were uh, 1100 each. Yeah. So, you know, about like $25 Canadian or something for like six tacos, which is not too, too bad. No, especially for like the quality that they were and like yeah. the taste. Damn. Otherwise, like very like good looking place, very nice ambiance, a little loud, but that always depends. It there could be just people there. Birthdays. There was yeah. like someone came out and then like an yeah. hour or something. It's like else three, came out. like two tables Actually, of like four 12 altogether. people or something. Yeah. yeah. It was a bunch yeah. of birthdays and stuff, but overall, like it was still very nice. It was only because we were filming. Yeah. Like if we were there with just with people, it wouldn't yeah. matter. But I think that with the microphone, hopefully, it's gonna be. Well, it was 
pretty you, good. You already know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so that's pretty much it for that. Yeah. Good restaurant, would recommend. We're Absolutely. probably gonna go back uh, again with friends, maybe. I think so, um, yeah. We need to tell about this place because that was pretty good. Yeah. So, Pepper Tree in Westland. Yep. Just beside like a. Uh, the Inti tower that has Indy, honey and dough. Dough and everything. Yeah. So, yeah, overall, great evening. Hopefully, you learned a little bit more about our love life, where we're from, where we're going. We didn't talk about where no, we're going. No, I don't know. I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with this. Bit. Anyway, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and see you guys in the next one. <laughs> what is going on, everyone? Welcome to the channel. I don't know, today is day night. Yeah, oops. <laughs> okay, one, two, three. <laughs> Am I filming right now?